Hey guys, this is Elizabeth from Madero Green Moments and Madero Vlog Moments. Today I have a video to share with you a room tour of the newly renovated Pop Century rooms. OMG, I cannot wait to show you guys what it looks like. All right guys, welcome back. Okay, so if you've been watching this channel for any length of time, you know two things. Number one, that I'm an avid Disney fan. I'm obsessed with Disney, absolutely love it. We come here as much as we can because we're annual pass holders and we're just obsessed. And number two, our favorite resort, our resort that we like to go to the most is Pop Century. So it is affordable, so we're able to come often, but this is our first time staying in a renovated room. And to be honest, we were blindsided. We had no idea it was going to be renovated. And so we are avid Disney vacationers. We come often. We have a system of where we put everything. It takes us like 10 minutes to get everything unpacked. And we came in and we were like, oh my goodness, like what do we do and where is everything? So it brought the level of excitement. So I'm going to share with you guys what the room looks like. Let me know in the comments down below. Have you stayed here before? Let me know. What do you think? Do you love it? I think it's growing on me. I think I'm really impressed. I think it's kind of cool instead of being a little dated and um, it's just looking fresh. So that would be like my best word to describe it. So I shared with you guys on Instagram. If you're not following me, follow uh, Madeira Green Moments as well as Madeira Vlog Moments and you can see all the stuff that's going on see what our room looks like and um you can see it all right let's get into the video all right let's start off with our view here from the room from the actual room you have a majorly obstructed view but when you go outside i'll tell you why room 4360 is amazing because we're the last one so we have hardly any traffic coming by us here and when you get past these trees you'll see over in the distance over there there's water and it's really calming and peaceful we're liking it although during the daytime there has been some construction because they're working on that skyway uh, transit that's going to go that way towards art of animation but um, hasn't been too too bad we've really enjoyed the privacy so let's come All right, guys, when we first came in, we got settled. So you're going to see uh, things in this room. So it's not a uncluttered room. We are definitely staying here. So let's just talk about when you first walk in. We have stayed here so many times, guys, I can't even tell you how many. But there used to be two double beds. And there's clearly an oversized bed over there. It is definitely bigger than a double bed. I don't know what size it would be classified as, but my husband said in previous Pop Century rooms, his feet would hang off the end of the bed. Anybody else? I, we found it was super tight. So I don't know if this is necessarily an, a bigger bed, but it sure feels like it. Also, it's a new mattress, guys. It's like a pillow top, heavenly mattress. We've stayed here one night and we've been in heaven. All of these pillows came with the room, but that teal one. So what is that? Four, eight pillows, which is unreal. So we have not had any issues with pillows. And then this table and chairs, the chairs you move out of the way, and this bed is a Murphy bed. And so the kids were thrilled when we got to bring it out. Um, and I will definitely show you guys that in a little bit. Now this stand is covered up with my son's memorabilia. <laughs> if you've seen him previous previous vlogs, he bought Stitch with his own money. Well, this year, we are here right now for my son's eighth birthday, so we're celebrating. So he got birthday money from both sets of grandparents, and look what he bought, the giant Baymax. Oh, so much fun for his bedroom, right? <laughs> so this is new. Previously at Pop Century, there was only one nightstand for both beds to share with a phone on it and with a plug that was hard to get to and a little bit of storage. Now you have one, two... Hold on, wait for it, wait for it. <laughs> Three nightstands. Not only are they equipped with two plugs each, but two USB ports. Oh my goodness, guys, what a game changer. Thank you, Pop Century. 
I have been bringing a USB hub to charge all of our devices and now we can have them on our own stands. The other thing that I've had to do in previous years at All Star and Pop is bring one of those two chairs over here and there's always been a plug around here and I've had to plug my stuff in and put it on a chair so I could have my drink and some of my stuff. Like how cool. And not only that, but they're like floating shelves. So kind of cool. We've got a headboard here. <clears throat> cool Mickey pop art and very cool artwork. And then let me show you this side. So we've got some orange and white polka dot curtains and then right here is some really cool dresser and a massive flat screen so we're finding that the drawers are pretty shallow and it's given us some more space but there's no fridge on this side now so we've got lots of space up here for our stuff to be cluttered previously the dresser had like hidden storage underneath like an extra shelf for us to shove stuff so it wasn't looking so crowded and previously the table would be over here for two people to sit but now it's here when the bed is down it's feeling a little closed in and they've added this piece of furniture so when both beds are down there is nowhere to sit you have to put your chair here and there but you don't really have a table so it's a little odd the other thing is is the mini fridge is here there is no shelf above the fridge to kind of hide stuff everything has to be exposed which for me being an organized person makes me a little bit anxious but if you have teenage kids i remember being a teen and coming with my parents and staying at All Star, you wanna have a space to put your stuff. And so I really have to give it to them with this reorganizing of pop century rooms that they found spaces for people to put stuff. So if you're here with three other friends and you all have a bunch of stuff, this is awesome. So <clears throat> it also has a coffee maker now, which is new. <laughs> all the food guys, the stuff that we brought, we've done food videos before sharing what we bring to Disney. <clears throat> and then in here, is a drawer for you to hide stuff. So we've put tons of snacks, I've got kids, but this stuff in here, minus the grape jelly, this all came with the room. So there's one coffee or two coffee packs, which we're not using because we're using our refillable mugs down in the food court. And there's some decaf, a little bit of sugar and some coffee mate. So that is really nice. So if you're one that wants to have coffee first thing, as soon as you get going, really nice to have that here. We don't need that because we'll just go downstairs and grab it thermostat looks pretty standard um, and then there's a spot to hold your luggage so let's go this way the other thing I really want to mention that is huge guys is they've raised the beds why is that a big deal you can put your suitcases under the beds <laughs> you used to have to way over here in the closet you'd have to put your suitcases in there or they would be on the floor space taking up room over here so that is definitely new. The other thing is, is the floor, guys. Check this out. It, I'm not used to it at all. It used to be carpet, and now it's like hardwood. Like, I'm sure so much easier to keep clean and to maintain and not to look gross, but it's odd to be in a hotel room with a hardwood floor. I, I'm not complaining, just sharing what it is. We've got these hooks, which used to be here. And so I'm not sure if all the pop century rooms look like that. The other thing I wanna show you is we put a birthday banner up here because my son's birthday. But take a look, there's no more curtain. There's no more artwork. And this door is a pocket door, but it just kind of slides like a more like a barn door. The other thing I wanna share is from the bed view. So if we are laying in bed, this is now our view. We have a view of a TV, shelves, and shelves. So when you're laying in bed, it really doesn't look like you're in a Disney resort at all. There's no touches of Mickey or Disney. It is above your headboard, so it's cool when you walk in. But when you're laying in bed, it's not like there's any pop century Disney. It just feels standard. And I don't like that, I do have to say. I wish there was like a piece of artwork here and they put the hooks there just to remind you like where you are and why you're staying here. Okay, so here's the bathroom. Again, way more storage than we need. And we are staying here a full week and we brought a ton of stuff. So oversized rectangle tiles, really liking the clean, simple, modern look. There is teal paint in here. So it's mostly orange in the other room. And then we have a massive mirror with lights around it, a um, whatever that's called, a closer up mirror. Make, I can't remember what it's called. Um, we've got toothbrushes that we put here in just in some cups, but you have um, a, a sink, more storage, um, hand towels here, more storage, <laughs> more storage, a shelf above, and lots of storage here on the counter. 
in here they um they have a iron and a blow dryer which i moved up to the shelf because i found that that was not necessary for us to have oh it's like the fan is automatically kicking on why i don't know okay so in here i put my blow dryer my curling iron and stuff and so we still have this empty storage <laughs> Here is an ironing board. There's nothing above. One hook, which we have hung our laundry bag. So we put all of our dirty clothes in that before we come home. And then we come home, it's separate from our clean clothes. And then down here, we have three shelves. So my family has used the drawers over there. And then I have used this shelf, one for shoes. This one's empty. And then some hangers, which has been really nice. So let's work our way into the bathroom and I think that's all there's to show you. Oh, let me show you the door. So another feature, which is huge guys for these, for Pop Century and All Star, if All Star would do this too, is this is a pocket door. So the other one is more like a barn door, but this one, the reason why it's huge is because if you've ever stayed at a value resort, you know you cannot sit on the toilet and open the door at the same time. In fact, you have to shimmy out of the way because it's going to bump your knees and hit you because there's zero space. That toilet is like, if it's here, that door is almost scraping it. I mean, it is tight, they made it work. So you've got a floor length mirror here, so you can see, hello guys. And then you open this up and it's gorgeous. So the fan is temperamental. You can't turn it on when you want and turn it off when you want, it goes. It's got again, these sliding doors. So again, very streamlined and pretty. And then above the toilet, we have some shelving, toilet roll holder. And then in the shower, so it's not a tub, which I don't know if they do have tubs here at this hotel at all, but I know when I had little kiddos, that was huge for us. And then there's no toiletries for you to take home. <laughs> If you love Disney toiletries, you know that's one of the perks of staying here is that when you use them, you can take some home, but you can't take any of these home. One shelf and then really cool tile and a dual head shower and then a um, thing you can bring over to hang your swimsuits to dry. We're heading home, but I never showed you guys how the bed works, so here we go. Kind of cool. Everyone say bye, Disney. Bye, Disney. We'll see you real soon. All right, guys. If you like these kinds of videos, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already to see more videos like this one. I post here every Monday and Wednesday about our vlogs, our adventures, our travels, um, milestones with our family, but mostly Disney and cruises and vacations. So uh, stay tuned for more videos. I'll see you guys later. Bye.